We have so many programs that cut across human services. Those who are going into education typically are going into some sort of teaching field. Similar with counseling, they're typically going into either private practice. Uh, a lot do work within college counseling, such as uh, the Miller Wellness Center here, Human Development and Family Studies. Uh, it depends on whether they go to graduate school or not. Uh, so those who go to graduate school, it's often in counseling, social work, uh, physical therapy, occupational therapy. If they're going directly into a profession, um, it's things such as social services, nonprofit leadership type work. Really, it's any human service field. We have the Exploratory Studies program for students who come into the university who are not really sure what it is they're wanting to study, where they're going, but they're ready for college. The School of Education, Counseling and Human Development um, really provides um, the experience that I'm going to need when I step into a school and begin my teaching because it gives me so many opportunities now to get into the classroom and learn how to deal with the students and learn about their development. Faculty are constantly changing what is happening in classes, addressing what is happening in the world. Uh, that's, that's one of the interesting things about being in these fields is it's never boring. There is that small class size where you can know your people Years, you're able to then do some of that cohort learning. I like the small size of it because I feel like I know almost all of the other elementary education majors and you really get to build those relationships. So the Fishback Center for Early Childhood Education is an important place that many students on the education side, early childhood side, will student teach at, assist at. HDFS students typically do observation hours. So they have that opportunity to continue to learn there as well. So a lot of students do some of their practicum hours, internship hours at the Child and Family Resource Network. So some of that parenting education, some of that family education, that's the main outreach place uh, in our area. I've already had to do like one teaching experience. So I went down to Sioux Falls Christian and I taught like a second grade math lesson. So one day I went and observed the classroom. The next time I went, I actually got to teach and implement my first lesson, which was really exciting. The programs have a variety of options for location, where uh, education, the undergrad is predominantly Brookings-based. Their master's programs are entirely online. HCFS has in-person option, online option, hybrid option, and then there's counseling. Counseling has in-person and Brookings uh, or online options. There's also the Rapid City campus. If people want to have a sort of meaningful career in terms of making a difference, in terms of working with humans, these are degrees to do it.